Hello Capricorn, welcome to your energy energy reading for the week of 22nd of August and I'm excited to bring you this new format. Um, you know, it all started out because I had some tech issues and decided to do the recording uh, through my computer and then I realized that actually, hey, this works better, right? And so it's much easier. So let's see. So Capricorn, this is a general reading for you. And I hope that this um, reading will inspire you and, you know, set you up properly for the week. So let's see. Can we have a message for Capricorn? And here we go. So Capricorn, meditate and contemplate. It seems as if this particular energy is pointing towards a very quiet start to the week. Um, take some time for quiet contemplation, meditate. I feel like you are at a crossroad, you know, Capricorn, as if you are... Um, you have to make a decision uh, about this direction and this is a decision that is very, very dear to you and very important to you. And so some quiet time is really necessary for you at this time, right? So sit down, contemplate, meditate. Okay, so let's see what the second card is for you. So Capricorn, for the other signs so far, they seem quite explosive. A lot of things happening for them. Um, you seem to be starting with a slow start and so let's see what the second card brings to us. Your hard work is paying off, right? So this is nice. Um, I feel for you like the energies are quite mellow. Um, it's as if, you know, the storm is over. It's as if you, you've you been through the storm and then now you're just settling down. And so your hard work is paying off, right? So sit back, relax, enjoy the rewards. And I feel this has to do with uh, both your personal life and your professional life. Um, it's as if that you have, you know, put in many years of work in your professional life and you're now, you know, reaping the rewards and maybe you're thinking of just slowing down and, you know, some of you, if you're in retirement mode, right, then this is perfect for you. Uh, on the personal level, I feel that uh, you have also put in a lot of work in, some relationships and they are paying off right now, uh, especially if you are raising uh, raising a child or raising children and you have come to a point where, you know, your children have reached a level of maturity, you know, uh, they're leaving the nest, so to speak. So you have the sense of um, stability, quietness, very mellow kind of energies, right? So, so it's nice energies for you in the coming week. So let's see um, what we have for you, the third card, Capricorn, and look at the bigger picture, right? So it's asking you to look at the big picture. Um, I feel also Capricorn for you is uh, is pointing towards the future. It's asking you to look at the big bigger picture for the future. So at the moment, it may not seem like whatever plans that you have, um, even for the future, it doesn't seem like it's very fruitful for you. Uh, or you or you're not able to see it as yet you know how how the outcome will be fruitful for you um, so you are encouraged to look at the bigger picture so take some quiet time you know to meditate contemplate on this and the answers will come and you will have you know more clarity about the direction to take and also you know how to navigate through um, certain complications that may come in uh, but I don't I don't foresee um, anything too too turbulent for you in the coming week, right? Energies are mellow, energies are quite calm. So you just need to take things calmly, okay? And not allow any hiccups to come in to throw you off course. So we're going to pick one clarifying card from this deck and see what it says for us. And it says, happily ever after right so i you know as i've said earlier in the you know with the other cards the energy seems to point to um you know like everything is paying off you you see the fruit of your labor and so this is a confirmation about that so i'm happy for you capricorn and i hope that oh how interesting that we have a unicorn um here you can see right and yeah very magical i feel right happily ever after it's nice energy for you capricorn um let's pick one from this deck this is the soul truth one 
and let's see what kind of encouragement we will get for you um, as you move forward and okay so let's pick one and it says what am I looking for outside myself that is already within me this is a very good reminder for you right it's asking you like why do you keep looking outside when everything is within you very good reminder so your sole action today is to breathe in your favorite essential oil deeply into your belly right so stay present stay connected with the earth right that's the message um, drop your shoulders and spend some time hanging out with your soul today so again we bring up this card the first card that you've got meditate and contemplate right so the cards are supporting the energies uh, that we are picking up and uh, you know what the week is going to present for you quiet right and uh, a very good time to really take stock of what is really going on and also you know practice gratitude um, and it seems as if you know with all the rewards coming into your life it's time to really show gratitude um, to those around you and to all the help that you have received so far. So Capricorn, I wish you a wonderful and blessed week ahead and I will see you again next week. God bless.